Barry here with Big River Pets. I'm standing in for Matt, so let's see how well I remember my fish. It's been a while since I've done a video. Just a small order, nothing too crazy. First up, we got female bettas. These are the Half Moon Candy females. A lot of cool colors, a lot of blues and reds in there. And we got our reticulated hill stream loaches. So, pretty popular favorite. Great in your community tanks. Do well in some of your nano tanks. As long as they're not too small. We have the L204 Pinstripe Nat Flash Pletco. Those are really pretty. Next we have the Reticulated Cori, the Cori Doris Reticulatus. Lots of Coris go through here. I think we've done several recent stocks on those ones. Not gonna see much, but it looks like we got a hairy puffer. So we'll try and get a tank pick with that one. Those can be pretty feisty when feeding, but otherwise pretty cool looking. And that's another 204 there for you. We have the Celestial Pearl, Dan Pearl Daniels, or CPDs for short. A lot of people like those in their nano tanks. Super pretty when they color up with the, that orange. Uh, the Green Neon Tetras, another favorite round here. Very similar to your neons, just a little bit smaller. And my box is empty. Let's get another box. Alright, so we got a second one. I thought there was a second bag on that list ordered. So I think those were jades, kind of a greenish yellow. It's hard to tell in here. But lots of mystery stills. We sell those like crazy. Keep in mind, they will leave egg nests, but they do it above the water line, so they're really easy to pull those out. They're kind of easy to control. Control them from, keep them from overpopulating their tanks. And it looks like we got some ghost shrimp. Lots and lots of ghost shrimp. And what for you guys. Oh my goodness. There's our feeder comments. Another one that will do that special on you. Um, you let us know and get it before we cut the bed. And that's all I got for you this week. All right, another box. All right, we have the Juro, Juro Perry. You probably butchered that. The Peru variety. I'm right. totally blanking on all the information on those. So. We'll put the scientific paint in research and come back and ask me what I can think. Uh, we have the redhead sub-rooms. Not very red at the moment. Give us the time to color up. Very cool looking fish there. Uh, cloud nine. So one of your monster fish. Those ones do get large. Make sure you have your big tanks prepped and ready. That way you're not scrambling to figure out what to do once you get some bigger. We have your runny nose tetras, one of our favorites. Don't forget, we do the tetra discounts by four or more with the subscription to our channel. If you're watching it, you should already be subscribed. If not, subscribe. Got an African butterfly fish here. These guys are really cool. Uh, make sure you have a very secure lid as they will jump out. Um, but they will also eat some of your smaller fish at night. So make sure you have size appropriate fish with them too. I do know that from experience. Uh, cynical bikers. So well, those ones we said those must go through. I believe those are one of your smaller bikers, but keep in mind they still get a good size there. Alright, let's find another box. Alright, got another box here. Alright, we got some common autos. Can't go without our autos. Nice little small algae eater. Great for your small tanks, planet tanks. Another great one that's not a fish, is your mono shrimp. Must have in your planet tanks. They do wonders on that hair algae that likes to crop up now and then. We've got some long nose angelfish. A little cloudy in the water, but everyone's looking pretty good. Angelfish, good with your community tanks until you get a breeding pair and then. Watch out for your other fish. Good to have a backup plan when they do that. 
can be pretty aggressive. Uh, Marvel hatchet fish. Haven't seen those in a little while. Nice to have those back in stock. A little on the small side right now, but once they fill out, it's really pretty. And then we've got another 204. So it looks like we got three of those in stock. Nice and our favorite, Betas. Looks like a bunch of different half moons. Lots of various colors. So let's kind of take a quick peek here. I don't have a whole ton like we usually do. And, uh, just a couple more. Two more. Look at the tail on that one. Gotta love our bettas. We go through so many of those. Hey! Should have some feeders down in here. Let's see if we can dig those out. So we got our feeder guppies. Remember we would do a discount if you let us know ahead of time and come pick them up before we cut the bag. Try a few boxes spare. Looks like I've got some snails. Let's see what snails we got. Double bag. Okay. Bad wrapped. There we go. So got some ivory mystery snails. Oh, nice white ones there. Get a good shot of those. Alright, so we got a second one. I thought there was a second bag on that list ordered. So I think those were jades. Kind of a greenish yellow. It's hard to tell in here. But lots of mystery sales. We sell those like crazy. Keep in mind they will leave egg nests, but they do it above the waterline, so they're really easy to pull those out. Kind of easy to control. Control them from keep them from overwatering. Lots of ghost shrimp. And what for you guys? Oh my goodness. There's our feeder comments. Another one that will do that special on you. Um, you let us know and get it before we cut the bag. And that's all I got for you this week.